Sunday, happy Sunday, all is well. Well, happy last day of June. Like, cannot believe it. And tomorrow is July 1st. So with that being said, me and Edna, we gonna do a 31 day July, we outside in July series. Cause I needed someone to keep me on my toes and she's the G. <laughs> so let's go ahead and kick it off. So that means every single day in July, there's either going to be a vlog or short of something that she, you know, or myself, we're doing outside. It doesn't matter, like I said, doesn't matter if you're on the porch, it doesn't matter if you just walk in to take the trash out, as long as you did something other than being inside, but outside. So, let's go. Hope y'all having a good morning. I'm about to get my coffee. It sounds like it's empty in here, and that's for a good reason. And I'll explain that later. But, um, let's go. Peace. I do have one question for y'all. Now, we just got over the pandemic, and we're here. Good thing. But I have a question for y'all. During the pandemic, when we was getting all these stimmies and extra money, what was a purchase that you made that you regret? The dumbest purchase because you had extra cash. Or you probably wasn't like that and you probably still got your money stacked up. But I did waste a couple of those coins. And for me, the dumbest purchase I made. But before I show y'all, make sure y'all leave it in the comment section. What was the dumbest purchase that you made <laughs> with your stimulus money? I just want to know. Because for me, it was this right here. So this was my stupid stimulus purchase. I bought an apartment sized washing machine. Now it is a great idea, but as you can see, I also had to buy a pulley or dolly to put it on because voila, I have carpet and I can't leave it out like a piece of furniture. So I had to push it back in the closet. I only used it three times. It took more energy pulling it out. And then on top of that, the piece didn't, the nozzle did not um, go on, or what did not fit on my kitchen's uh, faucet. So then that was a problem. Everything was an issue. And the washer, the laundry room is literally right downstairs underneath me. But because we were in the house making crazy purchases, make sure you leave yours. Oh, and then I have a bonus this right here it's going out in the trash i never used it never just blowing up the stimulus the stimmies you can seriously order anything offline that is amazing and them tires look good i need tires hey happy sunday so the outside has continued I was on a project and I did not tap y'all in when I started it. So I'll show y'all later. I went into my um, walk-in closet and pulled everything out. And I've already gotten rid of like three, you know, the, um, the, the midnight move out special bags, the real big black garbage bags. I had two of those filled up to capacity drop them off at Goodwill and now I have two more bags if I did not wear you in the last well for me it was almost the last 20 years it had to go that's the type of time I was on so I have the bare minimums now just what you see me in now I'm a minimalist again <laughs> So, by Sunday, I will be dropping that off. Then I think I have to stop at Pop Pops to do his hair and grocery store. But I'm outside. Remember, we outside every day. Somewhere. Right? Sometime. I'm going to see how creative I'm again. Yes, I'm here to bother them. Mm-hmm. Get that out the way. And I hope my mom cooks something good. Then I could pack some lunch. Let's see. I had to get Pop Pop right. Pop Pop ready. He ready for the summertime. You gonna be outside this July, Pop Pop? Yep. 
Yeah. All day, every day? Every day. <laughs> My mom said she was going through her paperwork and found this old picture of me. And, oh, wow. And I also wrote something on the back. It says, to granddaddy. Oh, my mom wrote it. I was five. And then I I think I wrote the word money on here. Because <laughs> that, that was my handwriting. Oh, too cute. We all, me, Terry, BB, we all look alike. See, this is the real reason why I'm excited because it's Sunday. Because I'm going to Walmart. It's going down. Yes. And then I went to the big Walmart. So I'm going to be walking in here for hours just looking at whatever. The whole, I'm going to start from one side to the next. And I got my fuel. <laughs> this is why I have to have a list one coming in this place and i stuck to it i think i'm doing good i nothing in here is everything on here is on the list so fingers crossed <laughs> and it's in the good let me show y'all for real y'all think i'm lying see i'm doing good so far everything is on the top so that means i'm sticking to this list <laughs> i spy with my little eye white grape not too bad i think i stuck to the game plan and i was able to get me some snacks so let's hope that the total comes up close to what i was kid it that's why i was like trying to every time i put something in the cart i placed it on the on the calculator so let's see i was two dollars off so not bad not bad always got ball on the budget I had to make a pit stop, so I'm here. I came home and I made some cheeseburger lettuce wraps, had some sweet potato fries. Oh, I had made some like a whole smothered onions and put that, oh my God. So I'm full. That rain came down so heavy. So I hope no one got caught in the rain. If you did, hope you were safe. But I think the BET Awards is on. I'm not watching that. I'll wait till they, you know, make, they play some stuff on what, TikTok or whatever. But right now I am watching some TV and I'm going to get ready for tomorrow. That's going to be my night. So I hope everyone has a great evening. Remember, we're getting ready for tomorrow. Oh my gosh. It's Sunday night and tomorrow is back to work. But da -da 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 -da, tomorrow is my grandson's birthday. He's going to be six years old. So I'm so excited about that. I had to run to the store to finish up his birthday gift for tomorrow. So I did all of that. And I'll see y'all in the AM. Peace. Day one. Damn. We outside this July. Let's go. Peace out.